my guys have done it again introducing Coley AI it's just as simple as you type in in something and the creation comes to life right before your eyes and look it's available to you right now click the link at the top line of the description box right now this is the most amazing app ever try it now for the greatest rapper. all right so 50 cent did an interview on million dollars worth of game where he took a very strong shot at Dame Dash. I'm going to play what 50 said. And then Dame Dash actually responded today. I'll let you hear from both of those gentlemen. Then I'll give you the uncensored truth about what's really going on. Hey, man, hit the thumbs up button. Let's get to 50 and then Dame Dash. How much money did he give you for that first deal? I got a million dollars. Cash. Right at the taxes. Mm -hmm. The only person that pointed out that a million dollars was no money was Dame and Dash. And he has no money now. Mm. Mm. If I only no, I only felt that, you know, because he said, well, there ain't no money. Like you, after you get you a watch, a chain, and you look out for the homies and you do this, then it's nothing. Right? And I was like, I think I'm from 134th Street. I mean, no, this is a lot of money. Right. <laughs> I think I hit the lot of Right. Are you gonna say there's no money? Like that was and I just never forgot that because of how it felt. Was that the only offer you got? Were any other labels offered you? I met with everybody. I met with Clue, there's a storm, all of them. It's because I wanted them to say they was doing a deal with me. How much money did they point out that Somebody definitely sent me that cute shit, uh, 50 Cent, about um, me not having no money. And uh, because of that, I feel like um, now me and 50 should have a battle. And, uh, you know, no gangster shit. I'm 53 years old. That would be whack and corny for the culture. But he's in the television network business now. So if I was a rapper, I would be like, all right, I'm going to make a diss record. You make a diss record. Now, let's not do that. Let's do CEO war, right? You drop your television network today. You should be able to do that because you have power and you have the resources and, you know, you get money. And because I'm broke, this should be easy work. I'm going to drop my network. And what I'm going to do is I'm also going to drop a new original American new movie. So I also challenge you to drop an original movie. Do it today. You should have it on deck. You're a CEO. You should be prepared for this. But I guarantee you, you're not. So today I'm dropping American new. You type in America. You type in NU. You check out my network. Go check out. What's the name of his network again? Fifty Cent Action. Oh, hell no. You can check out. 50 Cent Action, I'm promoting it. Go to 50 Cent Action, however you could go there. And go to America New, type in America, type in any or any app store, download it, and tell me whose app is better. But I need you to show up for this battle, 50. You know what I'm saying? And also, I'm gonna drop a new movie. Uh, the Prince of Detroit, an America New original. And produced by us, and we put it in theaters. And now I'm putting it on my own streaming service, you know, because I ain't got no money. And also, I'm going to do a full interview. And I'm going to put it on my network first, American New. And you'll be able to see that as well. And, uh, you know, again, let's just compare. Also, um, 50 was popping it. Uh, for what I heard, that, you know, we had that 12 million to buy uh, Rockefeller and BJ's boss. But where you at? It's still for sale. The prices are up, but you know, they pushed the auction back. The starting price was 1.2, that was 3 million. Um, if you got it, like you say it, buy it. I challenge you. So, let's keep it. Television Network, CEO, and watch the full interview on America New. Watch a new movie on America New and tell me whose network is better. 50, 50 Cent Action or America New. And um, 50, I don't mind if you want to post the battle as well. Because I'm going to post it on mine. We should help each other. You know what I mean? Appreciate you. Now, you know what? I'm going to be honest with you, man. I think this is silly as hell. First of all, I respect both of these brothers. Um, You know... I always was vocal about some of the things I didn't agree with with Dame Dash and both of them have amassed millions and have done great things in the culture and for the culture. Let's just keep that a hundred. So 
this whole competition thing, let me start here, right? Because this whole competition between brothers, man, has to stop, yo. We always got to do the demeasuring contest. We always got to see whose is better and whose is this and whose is that. At the end of the day, look, you had a $300 million company in Rockefeller, you know, um, Rockaware, all of that. Big money. 50 Cent is, you know, just is putting up a $20 million studio in Shreveport. G-Unit Brands. Done a lot of music. He's an icon of mogul. You were a mogul. Still an icon of some, you know, so to me, it's, it's no, you know, you battle on network. I think it's silly. I think it's silly. Now, the response, see, Dame Dash shouldn't even respond, respond it. You shouldn't even respond it because 50 Cent is not going to respond to that. And it's making yourself just look a little, I ain't going to say desperate, but like, come on. Now, I get it. The man took a shot at you or whatever. He said, now you're broke. And the reason why people are saying you're broke is because, you know, with this, all the debt that you're in. People will feel like if you're a multimillionaire, you just pay that stuff off. Now, I don't know. We'll see your bank account. But people feel like if you're a boss and it's that, you'll pay off your different debts. Now, maybe you got a grand master plan that we don't know about, right? And then about 50 Cent buying a catalog. Why would he buy the catalog when Jay-Z's going to get it back in, what, five or six years anyway, according to Jay-Z's legal team? So we got to stop the demeasuring contest. We got to stop always trying to battle each other. And that, even when even we in the game, we trying to collaborate with people, and they see us as competition. I'm like, you're a celebrity. You done been in the game 20, 30 years. You look at us as competition? We always got to do that. That's the first thought that we have is one of those things, like, man, like, come on. like. Now, I would like to see these two brothers work together. Y'all both into the... Films, Dame Dash does the independent thing and, you know, 50 Cent does it on a, a bigger scale. But how about y'all work together? You know? How, how, what is Dame Dash? What's, what's the net worth of America New? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. You know? So it's one of those things where it's like, come on, man. I'm not, I could easily feed into it and start going in on either one of them and saying this and that. But I say, man, look, collaborate. I just don't rock with each other. But that competition thing, and I get it, some things are competition. I'm a competitor, right? But why do it, like, y'all both made it, bruh. Y'all both already there. So why keep trying to belittle, but see, that's, that's what our culture has turned into. That's what it's built upon. How you can shine on the next brother. My girl look better than yours. My D's bigger than you. I got more money than you. My chain, you see Dame Dad's holding his chains. My chain is bigger than yours. My net worth is more than yours. My network is bigger than yours. All this. It's childish at the end of the day. It's childish. It's childish. We got to grow up. We got to grow up. But that's my thoughts on it. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section. And uh, yeah, leave a comment. I'm going to hear what y'all got to say. Make sure I hit the top line of the description box to go check out the best app in the world. All you do is type it and it creates it. The app. Is at the top line of the description box. Click it now. Hit the thumbs up on the way out. Peace.